here today. The starting pitchers are brought to you by Lexus pursuing perfection. It will be Pedro Martinez on the mound for the Red Sox the perfect 5 0 record this season a 192 opponents batting average against only Derek Lowe better in the American League in that category. He'll be opposed by the veteran James Baldwin with a record of 3 and 3. Pedro Martinez dominant in his career against the Seattle Mariners. A record of 9 and 0 in nine career starts against the M's with an ERA against Seattle of 0.91. He pitched the beauty against them last time out in Seattle, striking out 12 and in 8 innings. He'll try to continue his mastery of the M's in a moment. Sergeant Brian Bishop with our national anthem. He's from the United States Air Force Band of Liberty. Boston Red Sox baseball on Fox 25 is brought to you by your New England Ford dealers for the best selection of cars, trucks, and SUVs on the planet. Visit your local New England Ford dealers or log on to NewEnglandFord.com. By Budweiser with the crisp, clean, refreshing taste you'll find in no other beer, this Bud's for you. By your friendly New England Dodge dealers, grab life by the horns, go Dodge. By your New England Toyota dealer, what makes Toyota the best value? Ask someone who drives one. And by Southwest Airlines, bringing people together with low fares. Well, the weather hasn't improved very much in the two minutes or so since we were last with you. <laughs> there have been some nasty days over the years here at Fenway Park. That's going to happen, Jerry, when you play in the Northeast, particularly in the early and late season. But there haven't been many days more damp and raw than this one at Fenway Park. And usually the most uncomfortable ones are the ones with that winds blowing straight in from center field. And that's the case here this afternoon. How would you like to be these hitters uh, today facing Pedro Martinez in this condition? And Pedro will make the start. And as the Red Sox take the field, given the elements, a very nice crowd gathered here. And they've waited out a rain delay that has exceeded two hours now. The Seattle Mariners put their winning streak on the line. Their lineup brought to you by Southwest Airlines. Ichiro Suzuki, the right fielder, is the leadoff hitter. Mark McLemore, the left fielder, did not play last night. Despite the fact that he's been red hot, seven runs scored, six runs batted in, and an average of 579 over his last five games. He was five for five two nights ago in Toronto. Ruben Sierra, the DH. Brett Boone, the second baseman, the cleanup hitter. John Olerud at first base. Mike Cameron, the center fielder, will hit sixth. Then the shortstop, Carlos Guillen. Ben Davis catches and hits eighth. And the third baseman Jeff Cirillo will hit ninth against Pedro. Start number nine on the season for Pedro. The perfect record of 5 and 0, 3.09 ERA. He's got that down to eighth best in the American League. Pedro also at 54 strikeouts ranks third in the league in that category behind Kem Clemens and uh, Mike Messina. And the 192 average against is second to Derek Lowe. And as you mentioned, against the Mariners, a perfect 9 and 0 with an 0.91 ERA in nine starts in his career against Seattle. Doesn't get any better than that. And he pitched a dandy in his last outing against Seattle, went eight innings, allowed just four hits and one run while walking three and striking out a season high 12. Further indication that Pedro is in good health, that the shoulder feels fine, and that he's approaching the Pedro form that we're accustomed to seeing throughout the years. The defense behind Martinez this afternoon, Brian Daubach will play left field today. Johnny Damon in center and Trot Nixon returns after serving his four game suspension. Shea Hillenbrand the third baseman, Nomar Garcia Parra at shortstop. Ray Sanchez back in at second after having a night off last night. 
Jose Offerman at first, and Jason Veritek also returns to starting duty today. Red Sox have made only one error in the four games against Seattle, where they've lost three out of four to the M's this year. Jerry Meals, Eric Cooper, the crew chief Mike Riley, and Jeff Kellogg are the umpires from home around a third. And Ichiro Suzuki ready to lead this one off. Hitting 352 with 18 runs batted in. The rain delay two hours and five minutes as the first pitch comes at 310 and it's a strike. 41 degrees at game time. Ichi will take strike two, 0 and 2. Pedro working quickly, and he struck him out. 92 mile per hour fastball. On this cold day, it doesn't take Martinez long to get loose. He dispatches Ichiro on three pitches. He had 12 strikeouts in that last start at Seattle, the Sunday night game. That was a high for him this season, and right by Ichiro. It looked like Ichiro there was expecting Pedro to come inside. Instead, he goes to the outside corner to pick up the strikeout. Ichiro cost one of the toughest guys in the American League to strike out. He whiffs for just the 14th time this season in 160 at bats. Now Mark McLemore. Swings and misses at the changeup. He did not play last night with the left handed starter Darren Oliver on the mound as McLemore's hit just 190 right handed this year. 309 overall because he's hit 337 from the left. He's been a red hot hitter. The seven game hitting streak, the five for five game, including a homer in Toronto on Thursday night. That tied his career high. Second time in his career he's had five hits in a game. It also tied the Mariner Club record for most hits in a game. This is the kind of day everybody would appreciate the pitcher working quickly, and it looks like Pedro is making an effort to do just that. Certainly would help those in the field behind him. McLemore steps out. I have to think, Jerry, with the wind chill, it's even colder for these people than the 41 degrees because that wind is whipping straight in from center field. That wind blows in that direction. It makes Fenway Park a very big ballpark. Strike three. So Suzuki gone on three pitches. McLemore gone on three. And for Pedro and the Mariners, in case of here we go again, he has dominated this team throughout his career. And he's just overmatched two very good hitters to start this game. Well, last time uh, they faced Pedro in Seattle, Lou Pinella had uh, pretty much a jumbled lineup in there, didn't have all his regulars. Today he's got basically all the regulars in there, and so far Pedro's had the upper hand, back to back strikeouts, both on the fastball. Lou Pinella talked about competing against Pedro. He said the key is for his team to get a good start from James Baldwin. You know you're not going to get many against Pedro. You have to hope that the other guys don't get many against your starter. And Lou hopes that the Red Sox won't get many against Baldwin. Ruben Sierra takes strike eight. 329 for. Sierra, four homers, 25 runs batted in. These fans have had a long wait. Now they want to see Pedro strike out the side on nine pitches. And he did. After a half inning, Seattle nothing with an exclamation point. And the Red Sox coming up. You're watching the Fox 25 Red Sox television network. Where are the cars we were promised? The land-based rocket ships. 